Okay guys, I'm back for another installment, and as you can see, I'm, I got a different weapon, and, well, basically I got killed, I was out, uh, I got out of Electro, I found, I managed to find myself a rare gun, I found the MP, um, MP5, the, uh, silenced one which I think is pretty pretty quite rare and I was like yes I had like map and compass and everything and uh, I was heading out of Electro towards this castle and I ended up getting killed there <laughs> because I'm pretty sure there was someone uh, camping on top because um, well, the weird thing is, I didn't, I didn't hear any gunshots or anything, and uh, yeah, because I got to the second floor of the, the castle, and I was just picking up some loot, and then it just said that I got killed. So you must have had a silenced weapon. But I have no idea where he shot me from. So anyway, I started a new life. And the second weird thing is I ended up um, spawning way inland. Because um, as you can see, I'm, um, I'm actually, let me just check, I spawned there, in this town, which as you can see is way inland. So I've now just travelled west a bit and I'm here, because my goal is to check out the airfield, because I know there'll be some decent loot, because I'm hoping to get myself another Alice pack, because obviously I lost one before. I'm quite gut I got killed because I had a had the ass pack, had a the MP5 and I even managed to find a tent which would have been good because I could have uh, tried hiding that somewhere and they were to store, you know store some extra gear but oh well maybe maybe I'll come across another one but anyway, let's continue from here. And as you can see, I'm just gonna just checking out these barracks, trying to find anything decent. Because there's a town nearby which I'll have a look around after. But I'll stay, try and keep a distance from some of the major. Um, areas because there's uh, I think quite a few was that a blood pack? is that a blood pack? no it's not um oh yeah um sure that's uh, well that's a can <laughs> but if they want to do that that's fine I like to always, um, when I find, like, you know, food or more drink, I like to replenish what I have. I don't know, it's just so I can make sure I'm always topped up. Even though I know that you don't have to, uh, really eat or drink until it's flashing red. But, I don't know, I like to, oh. That's definitely a car I can repair. But no way I'll be able to repair that anyway. I haven't got enough slots to hold anything. But yeah. This is the first time I've come across a, a vehicle which looks in pretty decent shape. And that's 
time close to where I am. So I think at the moment I'm just going to check out this town because uh, I'm hoping it's safe from other players. But obviously not safe from zombies. <laughs> Look at that there. In the chat, they're saying about because he told everyone where his position was for everyone to go to the airfield. But no. But yeah, I'm really skeptical of um, trusting other players now. Because, you know, they got rid of the bandit skins and you, you don't really know what other players' intentions are. But I really think that they should really put them back in the bandit skins because, well, because they looked cool anyway, but it would always help to, uh, to know who is a bandit because it's easier to trust others because now I don't think anyone trusts anyone really so whoa it's a bit too close um, but yeah, this server doesn't have third person mode so I have to sneak about a bit. You know, the zombies coming this way. Why are you coming this way? Why, why, why? <sighs> yeah, I don't want to be using this AK ammo, so I'll just use my M9. Walk that way, zombie. Get away from me. Okay, so I want to hit that house because I know that's the entry wall. Oh, <laughs> actually, yeah, I shouldn't read really that. Do you don't want to. You guys definitely don't want to be seeing that because it can be quite sickening if you just keep watching that over. Okay. Um, look around. Zombies way over there. That zombie is walking away. Okay. Safe pass. Tower. Okay. Let's look in here. But no, yeah, well, give me. Um, Give me suggestions on, you know, where you think I should go, what you want, things you want to see. Um, because I've been playing this bit for uh, probably the last month now, and you know, I know basically most of the mechanics, except uh, obviously vehicles, because I think they were disabled for. Uh, for a while, I'm not quite sure. So flashlight, don't really have room for that. Should I take another bandage? So I just have room. Everyone's saying it's foggy. And there's maybe it's a little but it's not affecting me anyway. Um Okay. Loot, loot, loot. Um, let me just take some more food just in case. Because being out in the inland, uh, especially if you're running like all through those fields and everything, you you uh, end up wanting to eat and drink more. So it's best to have at least like a couple couple cans drink and food at all times. Well that's how I play anyway. But yeah, I think this is going to be the 
the end of another video, so uh, check back for the next one.